Yo, 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 what up, YouTube? Your boy Cucino here. Fire and draw. Today, we're talking about breaking news content. And mostly the most recent and the most juicy breaking news content worth talking about throughout this video so don't forget guys to like and subscribe hit that notification bell and share it and without further ado let's go okay so the first story we got is winning 1.7 billion powerball jackpot sold in california and this is crazy And the article says, well, what are the odds? Someone who brought, someone who bought a Powerball ticket in California won $1.7 billion prize Wednesday. Almost three months after someone else in the Golden State won the last jackpot. Damn, it feels like everybody's winning money. Makes you want to go to Wawa and buy a lottery ticket. Hopefully we win. Yeah. The winning numbers... Drawn Wednesday were 22, 24, 40, 52, 64, and the Powerball was 10. Damn. To get all of those numbers, do you know what is actually the probability of hitting every single number correctly? Damn. Your that chances of winning the lottery are pretty low. Very, very low. And it says in here in this article, the 1. 765 billion dollar jackpot one wednesday is It'll the second largest sum of money in the history of the game the oh, biggest powerful oh. jackpot was 2.04 billions and also won by someone in california in november oh damn the lottery business must have been losing a lot of money recently <laughs> Okay, guys, now let's go on to the next story. Florida teacher accused of molesting students on school grounds. <gasps> no. Again. Damn, like how many? How many more? A Florida high school teacher has been arrested for allegedly having inappropriate relations with a student, according to the Seminole County Sheriff's Office. Lucas is a teacher at winter springs high school he was put on administrative leave tuesday prior to being arrested wednesday deputies say they were contacted monday evening after the victim's mother learned that he exchanged explicit messages with her daughter a student at winter springs high school over the spring and early summer of 2023 damn during the course of the investigation, it was discovered that he also had inappropriate sexual contact with the victim on several occasions on the school campus. Oh my god, how bad can you get literally? Wow. I mean, I don't I really don't get why teachers are always interested in their freaking students. And look at his picture. Look at his picture. They, um, he looks freaking scary as hell. He was placed in custody and a bond was set to $75,000. Okay. Now, moving on to the real story of the day. Jada Pinkett Smith says she and Will separated already in 2016 let's see what the article says rumors about one of the hollywood's most famous couples have now been put to rest the actress jada pinkett smith has confirmed that she and will smith have been separated though not legally divorced but for about seven years already Pinkett Smith, also a talk show host, shared the revelation in an interview with NBC News, which were shown on Wednesday. The interview is part of a round of media appearances that Pinkett Smith is making to promote the publication of her new memoir, Worthy. Huh. 
Right now, it feels like the relationship started to become a business kind of relationship where they try to get most of each other and then they start on dropping literal bombs on us like this. In the interview from Baltimore with anchor Hoda Kot, which is set to be broadcast in full in a primetime special on Friday, Pinkett Smith said she and Smith had, had decided in 2016 to live separate lives. The detail is among the intimacies revealed in the memoir, which will be released on October 17. Then also they say, we were both kind of just still stuck in our fantasy of what we thought the other person should be, she added. The couple later shared more private details about their marriage in a tw- in a viral 2020 episode of Red Talk, Red Table Talk, Pinkett Smith's talk show. Pinkett Smith revealed that the couple broke up for a time and she began an entanglement with us with the singer August Alsina. You and I were going through a very difficult time, said Pinkett Smith in a discussion with Smith. I was done with you, Smith responded adding that the pair had decided to go their separate ways. I really felt like we could be over. The actress said she did not tell the public because the two were not ready yet as their partnership was evolving. How do you how do we present that that to people? And we hadn't figured that out, she said. You haven't figured it out. I mean you're already separated. What do you need to to figure it out more? Except for making more money. Yeah. Their relationship drew more attention during the Academy Awards ceremony in 2022 when Smith slapped the comedian Chris Rock on stage just during the broadcast after he made a joke about Pinkett Smith's hairstyle. The moment which stunned audiences and sparked discourse so widespread that it became known simply as the slap. The slap led organizer to ban Smith from attending the Oscars for 10 years. The couple have been separated since 2016 but have not filed for divorce. I made a promise that there will never be a reason for us to get a divorce. We will work through it, whatever. Pinkett said in previous of the in previews of the NBC interview, I just haven't been able to break that promise. Wow. That puts a whole other perspective on whatever happened in 2022 when the slap happened. For me, I really don't get it. If you say that you are separated from somebody, you are separated and you don't show up to the yeah. and you don't show up to the Academy Awards ceremony with somebody you're separated with and then when somebody makes when a, specifically a comedian makes a joke out of that person that you're separated with, I don't get why uh, Will Smith at that point had that reaction. So is it all just for money? Interesting. More to think about, more to think about. But this article definitely shows shows us, us that literally the Smith couple, I believe they are literally using their relationship as a business partnership in a way so we'll see more about that in the future i guess finally i wanted to end up this video with a nice funny video of the week so i'll let you see that all right gentlemen i want you to repeat after me just how i do it ready what i got that was funny well this is the end of the video guys hopefully you liked my breaking news content talking about the most recent and juiciest content let me know in the comments below how do you feel about, about this news make sure to subscribe hit that hit notification that. button and don't forget to like and comment down below it will make my day peace